Alright, we're inside their Class A motor home and I'm going to show you some of the stuff we've installed in here to help them with their boondocking. Okay, this is their wall that we installed all the different monitors and controls that they have. They have twin monitors, for one for each one of their MPPT solar controllers by Morningstar. And down here is their battery monitor. It's a Trimetric 2030 from Bogart Industries. Each one of these little red lights, this one here is for their Wi-Fi so they can turn it on and off. And this one here is for their cell booster so they can turn it off. That way they don't have to go back and unplug anything. And of course, their Magnum, they had a Magnum uh, modified sine wave inverter that was installed by Thor, but we changed it out for a pure sine. And it used to be hooked up to this multiplex system that they have here by Firefly. But we disconnected it because they had some troubles with that and they couldn't use their inverters. So we ended up putting this so it's a separate system. And this is the, the Magnum um, remote that, that they need to operate the system. So that way they don't have to worry about it if this breaks on them again. I'm going to go back here real quick and show you something. This is John's pride and joy. This is his airhead composting toilet. And as you see down in the corner is a little red light. That's another one of those switches that goes to the fan for that airhead. So if he needs to shut this down for a while, say they go on a vacation or something like that, they can turn that off and not worry about um, extra power being used. I'm going to show you right around the corner here. This was the only area that we could run to the roof with his solar. Well, it also ended up being a good place to install his wiring for both the Wi-Fi unit and we have his cell phone booster unit in that wall. We've got a vent at the bottom and a vent at the top. And then it's screwed on so that we can take that panel off if we ever need to do any kind of work or anything like that on there. But because of its remote location, that is the reason that we ended up putting these two switches on here. So there you go, guys. This is John and Brenda's unit. And I think they're going to have a lot of years of wonderful boondocking and enjoying this wonderful country we live in. You guys have a wonderful day and God bless.